What is going on, everybody? This is DLoner08, and I am back on the Haha -ha Sienda server. Guys, I've missed you. I have missed you. I It's been almost a month, I think, maybe. Time is weird, okay? <laughs> it gets away from you pretty quick. And I've been doing a lot of work on the server, been playing, just talking with some people, and having fun. I know I've said that the last couple of episodes. I'm going to try to get back into structured episodes, and I have a plan now. <laughs> I, I I need to get into doing something more regularly, and yeah, it, it will happen, just not this next week. <laughs> Maybe, I don't know. I've been busy, guys, okay? Well, um, just doing some AFK here. I had to fix up my elytra. Just watching the little guys swim down the hole to their death. But, like I said, I've been doing a lot of work. I'm going to show you this, this main base over here that I've been working on. Uh, last time you guys saw it, it went to there. <laughs> now it's just a little bit more. <laughs> Let's head over there and look. Uh, this is just a storage system, and it's not even a big storage system, really. There's only, I think, 64 slots. So there's two double chests per slot. So, But it all still only holds 64 items. So yeah, I've got a, a, a little bit of stuff already put in here. I, have, I think I've got maybe like one or two on each row that are filled in. That was Chewy. He said, hi, and I'm going to scratch my collar and make as much noise as possible. Chewy, stop it! Okay, he's done. <laughs> All right. <laughs> Stop making noise, silly. Okay, I think Chewy is done. Sorry about that, guys. Now I can go into detail on how this works. Okay, so we have eight different silos, bulk storage silos, and this is just mumbo dump, mumbo dumbo, mumbo jumbo's design that uh, you know, I just copied over. It's pretty easy, actually. Uh, I can leave a link in the description of where I found the tutorial for it. So yeah, pretty easy. So we have an input here and an output here. Uh, there will always be three in this no matter what, just because in each of the, the three spots there, one item gets stuck in the item elevator. And I can't really stop that unless I convert it all over to this side or this uh, style of item elevator, which I'll probably do in the future. And I'll show you guys that here in a second. But the the items just start here and just go into a loop. Uh, each time they get to an item elevator, they move over to the middle, shoot up, come back, and then circle around and then go down. <laughs> I'll show you that here in a second. But I wanted to start with putting some dirt in. Now, dirt is way over here, right there. So it'll make a full circle around. And the lights light up when uh, the items pass through, which is pretty cool. So they should be going up the item elevator right now, and it takes them a while to loop around and then come back down. But these lights should be turning on here in a second when they, the uh, dirt gets there. Come on, lights. You can do it. Yeah, there we go. If it's not as solid as when it's over there because the items are going one by one instead of... Like, the, the item elevator is slower because I didn't want it to get backed up. So you can hear the item elevator here working. When it gets to here, it just goes straight down. And then underneath it goes over, and then there's a little item elevator that shoots it up here. It's it's not too bad. But they pass through all of these item sorters, come around to here, get shot up. They go around this, this first part here, go to this item elevator. And then if it doesn't go through there, it goes around, around, over to here, to this <laughs> item sorter, and then down. And there's a lot of hoppers. That's why I've got all the droppers on here, which work better than furnaces, apparently. Or furni if I want to be politically correct. But in the uh, item sorter, or the item silos, I've got, let's see, I've got diorite, lots of netherrack, I think that's sand, gravel, smooth stone, cobble, granite, or uh, diorite, and andesite. So that's a pretty good amount of, you know, just your basic bulk storage items. And then each one of these has two double chests full of junk that it can fill up. So it's not too bad, I guess. Uh, I may put more of these somewhere else in the future. Not exactly sure. I don't. These these are pretty bulky, and they look really cool the way they're framed out. So at least I think. So the dirt should be flowing through here in a second. We're at 24, and I think I put in 22. So yeah, you see where the light stops? It's this first one from where it stops that it'll actually be going into. 
trap chest, so I can't really open it. So yeah, it's uh, this is what I've been doing instead of doing recording and yeah, it's been fun. I, I want to start on the creeper farm and I have a design in mind for it. And I think, yeah, I wanted to build it out there about the same distance as the, the fish farm, just like right in where that dip is, just because I can AFK up top here and not have to worry about you know, different mobs. I could build it in the ground, in the sub chunks. But, I mean, I don't need rates super, 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 super efficient. So, yeah, I'll probably just do it that way. <laughs> It'll be easier for me, and I won't have to dig out a giant hole again. Yeah, see, now there's 46, which was 22. So that's not bad. But, like I said, each one of these have, they're going to have uh, one dirt stuck in each because, yeah, that's just the way the system is right now. You know, one gets stuck. But this one, I think I can jump down here and show you how the item elevator works. I asked Skip, and he was like, well, why don't you use a, an observer clock? <laughs> and I was like, oh, duh, I'm stupid. <laughs> but basically, when there's an item that goes into that dropper up top, there's a comparator, which powers this piston, which will push the piston down. Cause the observer clock to go off, and then it just shoots the signal back into the dropper. Yeah. But it's pretty damn simple and small and amazing, and the other ones aren't as good. Just because of the fact that I'm so smart. Oh god, I'm stuck down here forever. Um, fly away! <laughs> but yeah, this place is it's looking pretty good. It looks pretty cool from the top, too. With all the, the different droppers and... I'm going to cover in all the redstone eventually, I think, but I've got the glass elevators there. I'm not going to I'm not going to put anything behind the glass elevator so you can still kind of see the redstone. But I think I'm going to box it down on this side. I'm just trying to find out the best design without, you know, redesigning too much. But yeah. <laughs> it's coming along, guys. It's coming along. It's a work in progress and it's taking me way too long to do, but I'm having fun doing it. And, yeah, I think I'm going to do a quick episode. It's not terribly long, but, I mean, next episode will be longer. I'm going to do the replay mod, I believe, to build the creeper farm. So, hopefully I can get that sorted out. If not, then it'll probably just be like this episode, and it'll be talking about random junk and trying to let you guys know that I'm still alive. Because I know a lot of you are wondering, where's Deal Owner? Where's the videos? It's like all nine of you. It's amazing. But <laughs> you can always hook me up on hook, hook me up on Twitter. You can always look me up on Twitter. It's Deal Owner 08, and I will message you back if you message me because I'm I'm lonely and nobody ever messages me on Twitter. And when they do, it's because of something else and um, makes me sad panda. But if you made it to this part of the video, if you can hit the like button, it'll make me feel better. See, look, it's already making me feel a little bit better. Look at that. See, I'm already 100 billion times better, but... <laughs> All right, guys. Well, I'm going to go ahead and end it because I'm tired and I need a nap because, you know, I wake up at like 4 o'clock in the morning and go to bed at 10 o'clock at night now. I'm an old man. Look at my old man pants. I mean, look, I've converted, guys. <laughs> All right. Well, anyways, I'm going to I'm gonna go before more derp happens and, uh, yeah. You guys, thank you for liking up the video and subscribing if you're new. And uh, hopefully I'll have a new video out next week. I'm going to really try, guys. I'm going to try. I'm going to try my hardest. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to record it right now. Not really, but because I want to go to bed, like I said. But <laughs> All right, guys. Well, thank you for watching. Thank you for subscribing. And we'll see you next episode, guys.